Hey guys! OMG, like it's been three, four months since my upload on this channel, and literally my channel has like spider webs on it. Anyways, I'm actually here to catch up with you guys, and I am going to update each and every one of you about what has happened during these incredible four or five months that I have not been uploading. First things first, I graduated from university and I got my bachelor's degree in Spanish finally after four years and yeah, I'm not living in Taiwan anymore as you can see. I moved to the States. I am in Illinois and I'm actually moving, well not permanently, I was going to say permanently, but I'm moving here to the States for two years because I have a scholarship for my master's degree and I'm actually going to be studying in the same university as my dad, which is kind of weird, but cool at the same time. And I'm so excited. And tomorrow is basically the International Student Orientation Day and I'm super super excited to see what like graduate school here is like in the States so yeah I'm excited about that and I've also been freelancing actually this is really this has actually been a while I've been freelancing in a company called Trip 101 and it's been super fun. I learned a lot about travel writing and apparently I can't speak English. Travel, the travel writing. Um, so I've been writing articles for them for the past year, I think. It's been like one year. I think it's been more than a year. It's been almost two years. But anyways, yeah, it's um, it's been a roller coaster. I'm working together with an organization called Lunamar for the Planet. You would see me wearing these colorful bikinis and it's just like a really cute design and really, I don't know, it's like really my style and I got that bikini from them. Basically after posting my first photo here, they contact me because they were very interested in my story, how I was very insecure about my body, how I came from a very conservative society that does not really allow you to show your body off like that, but um, I grew up in very different societies throughout my life, so I basically like... I'm not 100% conservative. I feel that if I'm proud of my body, I feel that I should have the right to express myself the way I want. And Lunamar basically offered me to be one of their Lunamar tribe. And I just, yes, I'm working with them for this one year. And if you're interested, I'll put the link down below. They actually make handmade bikinis, they make handmade bracelets and they are all handmade from Colombia and these bracelets and bikinis, whatever that, you know, whatever income that they get from your purchase, they give back to organizations, NGOs that are in Latin America, Africa, Asia, in Indonesia actually, in my own country, so this is what actually made me really want to work with them so it's like an opportunity to give back so if you want to check them out this is their link below I'll put it in the description box and yeah pretty much in the past that's what has been going on and now to the future I wanted to talk about this channel this channel has been really really it's very meaningful to me because because of YouTube, I've been able to open up myself more and I've met like a lot of you guys on the internet and I'm really grateful for it, but I think it's a bit like it's time for me to think about my future. I want to actually tell you that I want to change things up a bit. I'm doing my master's degree and I realize that I will have a bit more free time, but 
I will also not have free time. It's, it's hard to explain, but I don't think I will be traveling like every single month. I won't be out and about as much as usual, but I do want to continue YouTube. So the videos that I might be posting in the future would be different. It would be about traveling, travel related, but maybe more of like the preparations or post travel routine or travel DIY, etc. that would involve the things that I love. For example, room decor or makeup, etc. And this is, I think this is a really good way for me to spice things up and to actually explore different styles of making videos because I've been focusing on sit down videos and I've been focusing on travel vlogs but I've never really explored other style of filming so I'm very excited to try this. The last thing with this channel being changed and vamped up and all that ish it's finally time to announce that I have finally made the decision of making my own website. This is a very big step for me because making a website is one of the things that I've always wanted to do. But it is a huge commitment because I'm one of the persons that if I'm like excited about one project, I'd be doing it for like days and nights and I won't sleep. But then if I'm tired, then I would just stop. But if you have a website, you pay for the hosting, you pay for the servers, you can't really do that. You have to be consistent with your content and you have to be responsible. So this is a very big step and I'm excited to see how it goes. So basically, my website is called Her Coffee Diaries and I think this is really exciting because it's not just about travel, it's going to be about uh, my lifestyle, it's going to be about DIY, it's, it's going to be about my opinions, what I think about, you know, social issues and stuff like that. And as I said, I changed the content because I realize I'm not going to be traveling all the time but I'm only an arm's reach of a cup of coffee and I love my coffee and I feel that I'm most productive when I'm sitting in a, at a cafe or at my desk with a cup of coffee so I finally decided the name Her Coffee Diaries anyways that's it for today I hope you enjoyed this you know sit down video like quality time video and I will see you next time and I promise I will continue my India travel vlogs. Um, I'm actually editing a few footage right now so yes I hope you can see them soon and I'll see you soon. Bye!